Hey Capricorn, we're going to see what is going on. Keep in mind the energies can always be vice versa. And so, first of all, Marty's saying, it looks like someone could have came around or whoever, whatever this is, it's caused some type of distraction or you're trying to prevent something from being destroyed. Or this could have already happened. I don't know. Someone could have came in and just wrecked something. So that's what I'm seeing from that one already. Um, all right, Capricorn. What is going on with Capricorn? What is going on with Capricorn? Capricorn. So there's something about being patient. It's like something is sitting. Something's not moving possibly. There could be a lot of worry. You could be dealing... So you could be feeling like an injustice was done. There's just a lot of waiting, still in the dark about something. Um, Capricorn. Capricorn. You could be dealing with a Sag as well. Capricorn. So Capricorn, there could be someone around who's... You could be dealing with a water sign as well, a Virgo. So this could have been someone that you severed ties with already. Maybe you feel like you can't express yourself. You can't be open and free. And there could be someone around you who's not willing to be open and vulnerable with their feelings either. Um, Capricorn. You could be feeling like, I don't know, somehow oppressed or... I don't know if that's the right word. Um, Capricorn. There's a lot of people here. So maybe this could be a family situation, work situation. Okay. Hold on, because I dropped some. So, hold on. Your outcome looks like... Your outcome looks like a new beginning, but it's like once something ends, there's there's a change. So maybe something is still in the dark. You know what I mean? Because I feel like something is just sitting, you're waiting, Some something's not moving. But once something does happen, it's, it's a fresh start, a new beginning. Now, someone may come in and try to repair something or you know, different story. It just depends on what it's talking about. Um, I'm going to do just a quick love portion. Now, each deck, like I said, can be something different. All right. Uh, Capricorn. Capricorn. So, Capricorn, if some of you are single and are dating, someone could be coming towards you, you know, very passionate, very just whatever, but just be careful because you have deception at the bottom. Um, Capricorn. So you have not worth waiting for. Maybe this is just someone you don't need to wait around on. So if you're waiting for someone... I, you know, this may not be the one. Maybe you need to wait for someone who's going to be um, just as equal, just as loving, just as whatever. Maybe you've been putting up with someone's tolerance, you know, putting up with unconditionally giving loving to someone who's not doing you the same. So you just, I feel like some of you have just been putting up with someone. Um, I just, I honestly feel like you're done with someone. Like you're, you're not going to allow someone to keep treating you this way. All right, Capricorn. Capricorn. So, I don't think you're, I don't think this person, you're going to be able to forgive this person. Maybe something's happened and it's like unforgivable. I will never forgive you for this. Like, no. Something could be with finances. I just feel like it's unforgivable. Whatever this is. So, I feel like this is something that you you know, of course, a person that you know you've already been dealing with. Um, Capricorn. Cap 
Capricorn. So, you know, this, there's, it looks like there's a definite separation. You know, someone could have just been using you for something. Um, being very manipulative in a situation. Um, Capricorn, what is your outcome? There, there could be children involved. You have children at the bottom. For some of you, I don't, you may not even be focused on a relationship. Uh, maybe, you know, you could just be more focused on your, your kids. If you don't have kids, just something you, yourself, something that you're working on, you, you know, being creative, something like that. Um, um, all right, Capricorn, what messages... What messages do you have for Capricorn? I am the angel of marriage and I am assisting you right now. So maybe there's some confusion, indecisive about something, maybe what to do, something like that. Um, all right, Capricorn. Capricorn. Uh, hold on. I cannot get a grip. Okay. nine of cups the sun look this is your energy ten of pentacles the sun the nine of cups just happy exactly where you are so you could be happy have things going on just kind of at peace right now trying to be at peace and there could be someone who's trying to come in so there could be a negative energy who wants to they could come in and kind of ruin what you have going on you know it could even be just say if you have kids, it could be a friend, you know, you raise your kids, your family in a certain way. There could just be an outside influence who, who wants to come in and it could destroy everything that you've built, everything that you have going on. Um, but let me see, why is this nine of cups here? The, um, the lovers, but with the 10 of wands. So for some of you, like I said, it can be different things. But if you're if you're dating someone, this is your wish fulfillment. It's someone that you, you know, have these emotions for. They could cause you a lot of burdens, emotional burdens, pain, something like that. You know, this person could manipulate you because they know that you care for them. Um, I'm saying something about religion and spirituality as well, balancing the two, something like that. All right, what are your obstacles, Capricorn? So you have the strength card. What are your obstacles? So I'm definitely seeing, I mean, you have the Page of Cups, Page of Pentacles. So some of you could have children. Keeping it together. Oh, you know what I'm getting? There could be an issue going on, but you may not, maybe you hide this, maybe you keep it together for friends, family, whatever, but there's something going on that could be really like having you feel very boiled or like pushing your buttons. You know what I mean? Enraging you, but maybe you just keep it together to keep, keep the peace. So there could be an underlying issue still going on. I just see you waiting for something possibly. But say, just be careful because you have a seven of swords. There's an energy around you that I feel like is disrespectful. Something like that. They don't take accountability. They, you know, maybe you're not giving this person what they want. You're not giving in. Something like that. Um, what is your outcome, Capricorn? you have the hermit. Some of you could be giving someone the silent treatment. You could be still searching for answers, though, something like that. Um, there could be someone who, I, I don't know why I keep hearing the word disrespect. There could be someone around you who just disrespects you. You could be bending over backwards 
and you know, feeling like someone doesn't appreciate you, something like that. All right, Capricorn, what messages do you have for Capricorn? I mean, you could be dealing with a Pisces. What messages do you have for, uh, I'm trying to call you Pisces, um, Capricorn? You know, you could also be the one who, who always makes an effort, who tries, who does this, does that. And you're not getting some type of equal give and take back. So the answers you need are coming. Communication is key. So I'm getting that too. I feel like you're looking for some type of truth, clarity, answer, something. Um, all right, Capricorn. What is going on with Capricorn? All right. What is going on with Capricorn? So, being very kind, and see Capricorn, I feel like you are a very kind person. Very kind. Now, you do have some type of healing energy about you. I think you're a very good listener. You're very patient as well, until you're not, of course. Um, some of you, this could be like a father issue. doesn't have to be, but what are the obstacles in this? What are the obstacles? So... Feeling joy and companionship with whatever this is. Maybe you want someone to take uh, responsibility for their actions. Be more dedicated to something. You may have someone trying to get you caught up in their web, whatever that means to you. Um, so what is the outcome to this? What is Capricorn's outcome? Capricorn, I feel like somebody is trying to get you caught up, trapped in something. Hmm. It's, and you know why? I feel like it's because you're so loyal. Even if it's a friend, it can be anyone. You're just absolutely loyal. You may give this person, like, what they want, things they need. You know, you're just always there. So, all right, Capricorn, what messages do you have for Cap? See, I am generous. You, you're very, very generous. Overgiving. Um, what messages do you have for Capricorn? Maybe you just feel undervalued. I don't know. What, um, see, you're very compassionate. You are. Um, 77, that number may mean something to you, but maybe it's, Spirit is saying it's, it's something, an old pattern, possibly a habit. There's some type of fear. Um, just focus on your biggest desires, ambitions, things like that, like that. Now is the time to be brave and bold. Um, all right, what messages do you have for Capricorn? Now, there could be someone around you who has some type of a, uh, addiction I'm seeing too. Um, you could be kind of craving for something more, yearning for more. Or, you know, if this is not you now, it could be someone around you, someone else. You could also, so you do have mother healing as well. If I'm speaking to females out there, mothers, I feel like you're just an absolute, just amazing mother. So know that. Being a mother is the hardest job on earth. I don't care what anyone says. And a father. Um, okay, Capricorn. What messages do you have for Capricorn? What messages? So 
So synchronicity, pay attention though too. Notice like repetitious signs. Listen to your intuition, your inner guidance. You may get some very valuable information from something being very repetitive. Um, your prayers and questions are being answered by synchronistic events. So notice them in order to increase their flow. Hmm. All right, one more. What, what does Capricorn need to be focused on? What does Capricorn need to be focused on? What does Capricorn need to be focused on? I don't know why I'm feeling like don't snap on someone, Capricorn. Because I know you guys are so calm, cool, collective, very gentle, very kind until, you know, that's it. Anyway, um, so Spirit saying transition to a higher level of being, raising your energetic vibration and enlightenment. Embracing all aspects of yourself, which I, I feel like you do that anyway. So anyway, Capricorn, that is what I have for you. See you in the next one.